Hello everyone, welcome back to our shared channel. Today we are going to play with some toys. We literally are. So I don't know if you guys grew up in the 80s or 90s, but I feel like the 80s and 90s were literally the best decades for toys, hands down. Well, that's because there weren't iPads or anything yet. Because we had to actually go outside and do things or like make believe and find ways to yeah, entertain like, ourselves. Or yeah, I guess that's the thing. It's like the toys still involved imagination. Exactly. You didn't have to like turn your brain <laughs> off yet. You don't have to put on like VR glasses to enjoy your childhood. That would be cool though. So we started <laughs> looking through the internet to find some of our favorite like nostalgic toys. And also, this was all spurred by um, the Spy Gear episode because oh that was like always stuff that I wanted to buy when I was little. So now we were like, well, let's just buy a bunch of other toys we wanted when we were little. And this is going to be a multi-part series because quite frankly, there are too many toys to feature in just one episode. And we were like both freaking out with joy. I know. And I think this is just all that's come for now. So yes. that's just, there, there's like four or five things we're going to try today. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to keep it going because there's endless things that our parents wouldn't buy us that we'd love to try now. Literally, that was going to be my next question. My parents were like, go outside and play in the dirt when I was like, please, can I have the newest Cabbage Patch or whatever? They were like, no, you already have one. Why are we going to get you another See, one? See, I feel like I, I had some cool stuff, but then there are certain things that were just like hard nose. My mom was like, absolutely not. You're never getting that. Two of the things we're going to be playing today were included in that. 100%, uh, one of these is my dream toy that I've never even touched. And oh I'm my God, so okay, well let's bring okay, them let's out. Get, let's get started. Okay, so first I'm just As gonna- As acted like someone was going to bring them out for I'm us. I'm just gonna sneak peek this. This is gonna be featured in one of our next nostalgic toys episode, Moon Shoes. This is gonna be more of like the outdoorsy type things, but it's Look at kinda that overcast and rainy today. Another <laughs> quick sneak peek, another whole episode. Well, I'll show you a bunch of toys we're not going to yes. play with. Party okay. Mania. This was me and my sister's jam. This and Mall Madness, which oh my we're going to get a few of the old games. I want Girl Talk. Out. I want Girl Talk. I want Girl Talk too. This one specifically, it's you're trying to go to a party later and you have to, there's a VS, uh, wow, VHR. Uh, <laughs> What's it said, called? There's a VCR. <laughs> there's a VCR involved and you basically have to like, finish all of your chores before you could go to the party. So then the people leaving you, they're leaving you video messages. So it really was kind of futuristic. This was very high tech. This is 100% something my parents would have been like, get a life. Uh, no, me and my sister not. loved it. That my parents would have been but like, But anyway, on to it. today's Okay, choice. so we're gonna start small, Lil. Okay. We're gonna start small. We're gonna start classic with some silly putty. This was one of the things that my mom was very adamant that I was not allowed to have. Really? <laughs> because me That's and my so sister- That's so We did get it occasionally, this and the next thing, yeah which honestly, this is like the slime of the 1990s. It really was the leader. It was like foreshadowing. But for my mom hated movement. this shit because if it got in the carpet. Oh, oh forget about it. Over. Something else I truly love that we don't have that still exists. So Remember those hands that people used to like throw against this? Yes, oh, because those were also part of the, <laughs> the band because specifically at Lampos Pizza, um, if anyone's from Thousand Oaks, you know what I'm talking about because it's still there because it's fucking iconic, but they're arcade games and you can win prizes. Oh, the best. We would win sticky eyeballs. <gasps> I forgot. Oh that, my gosh, the, remember the how they're getting bubbles? That's my favorite part. So on the so box, it's like an it anxiety says, reliever. This, sil sil this silly putty pack includes a variety of favorite silly putty eggs and you can stretch your imagination. So I have the original <gasps> color. What color do you have? Pink. Super bright. Um. I don't know if I would say this is too, uh, like a, you're not making stuff out of silly putty. Why was this cool? Like, like this doesn't it, feel like an, imaginate, an, an imagination booster. This feels like a stress reliever. Something else I feel like we used to do is like blow into this. Like put a straw, blow into it and make bubbles. Oh, I never, <gasps> but that's made? another toy. Do you remember that stuff? Yeah, what was that? that? You, like it came with a straw and you'd make the huge like, yes. and Fiona's laughing cause she knows those commercials. Okay, yeah, no, I used to I do like this, this though is... where you like, you spread it out and then you fold it over and you seal the edges. Mm -hmm. And make a bubble. And make a bubble and then you, it's not really working it's order, but it worked a second ago. And, but, but it's non-toxic okay. so you can probably eat it, but I wouldn't recommend it. Ooh, that was a good one. All right, now I'm gonna bring in Gak, super stretch Gak, to be exact. Um, do you recall that Gak has a very specific scent? I haven't smelled it in so long that I don't really remember. I'm sorry, what does this say, furred it? Does that mean like it makes fart noises? I think so. See, I don't remember it being so sealed when we were <laughs> It was not sealed when we were children. Leave a comment below and let us know what year you were born. Oh, I'm so curious. If that's not offensive. Lily, if you had to guess, would you say most of people were born in the 90s or the 80s? Or the 2000s? Watching us, the 90s. Really? I think. 
Yeah, that makes sense, because you're like, because like if it, even if it was like oh. 98 or something. Once you pick it up, you won't want to oh, put it down. You can, ooh. Ugh. Oh my gosh, the smell. I uh, totally, uh, just every reason my mom didn't want us to have this came flashing into my brain right now. This is like wet. I love this. You guys, this is it's the reason fun. for slime. And thank you to Nickelodeon. This is slime. Wow. It is funny that Nickelodeon's the one that came up Originated with all this stuff. I, I love this. This is very Gak soothing. is back. Did Gak go away? Did like some generations not have Gak? Did you have Gak? I, let it, I'm I just so- I Gak. <gasps> I have a question. Everyone watching, um, if you watch Disney, do you remember the Disney didn't used to have commercials for oh, anything yeah. other than Disney? Because you were paying for cable, so cable never had commercials when I was a kid growing up. Because, well, this is like probably before. For, it was recall. just Disney. That it was like the advertisers for any of the other channels. All the premium cable, which Disney was originally considered premium cable. Oh. So like HBO and like Showtime and all of those. And if you had Disney, it was like, whoa. Oh yeah, I just remember it only being, and then there was Zoog Disney. What's that? Oh yeah, you were too old for that. <laughs> What's that, is that for children? I think it was like for teens. Yeah. It was like an old, <laughs> is that the fur? <laughs> I wonder what it would look like if I cut this. It's kind of soothing, I get it. I get the slime thing. Well, it's nice because then it goes back together. Look at that cheese bowl. Boop. Okay, next up. Okay, this is the toy. This is the toy. That you wanted. I have been waiting Same. for 30 years to open, maybe longer. Closer to like 35 years. I wanted this all the time. My parents were like, no, that is creepy. Did you know that my mom was a stay-at-home mom when I was little and then she went back to work when I was like, I don't know, third grade or something? My mom used to VHS record all of our favorite shows. You mean like, or I mean like Reading Rainbow and whatever we were allowed to watch and she would not record the commercials. She would edit them out because she did not want my sister and I to, to be see bratty the Teddy and commercials. to see all of the things we wanted and just be like, I want this cereal. I want this. I want this sort of like toy. I, so she, she tried to cheat the advertising agencies. She did. She did. And honestly, I feel like that's the only reason that uh, I wasn't more devastated about this. You know, the reason I know what this is is because uh, my friend had one, so I got to like live vicariously through her. Teddy bear. And get to go to her house and Guys, so this is basically a teddy bear. I remember there being a VCR element. Yeah. Or VHS element. This is probably element. the newer version. This connects via Bluetooth because this is the new one. Oh. The fact that they still have it. Like, this is a creepy toy. I'm, I'm not what, gonna lie, I find it to be very strange. I'm like, what brand is it? Did I see that his eyes have something weird going on? He has 40 plus full color eye animations to sync to stories. But he very conveniently comes with an eye mask, so. Oh, so we don't have to look at so it. So we don't have to look at him. <laughs> this is downloading. Um, I'm going to unscrew Teddy for a moment. This just feels wrong. Oh, nice. we're on. Bluetooth connect. Hi, my name is Teddy Ruxpin. Hold Can on. you and I be friends? I guess. I feel like we should give this toy away. All about bears. Come dream with me tonight. Teddy, hey Teddy. Huh? Oh, hi Grubby. What's going on? Well, Teddy, I'm just a little. So Does he have multiple personalities? <laughs> yeah. What's going on? Let's start reading. Okay. Press Teddy's right paw. Some bears are bears, and other bears aren't bears. Oh, <laughs> I see what you mean. Oh, good. But you can clear it all up. What? Well, I don't know if I can do that or not. Sometimes bears don't even know whether or not they're bears. Really? Teddy's having an identity crisis. Wait, why is there, I don't like this. I don't why understand there, why there's why multiple there, personalities. Why is there a pull oh tab gosh, on the pull it off, pull it off. The LCD eyeballs. Oh. Whoa, I don't like that. I feel like we should burn this and it's gonna be like possessed and make noise. Look at his eyes. I don't like it at all. I don't like this. We done? I'm done, I'm Get done Get the baby, this. that's even creepier. You should delete Teddy Ruxman off your phone too because he's probably gonna be trying to spy on you. Another thing my parents would not allow me to have a doll with a wiener that pees. It is a wiener. Is that what it has? Yes, it does. Look. I don't know. You bought it. And Ew. Little, he pees. Yeah. But, okay. First of all, I don't think children need to be cleaning up after babies. Second of all, I never had any like baby dolls, really. 
Here's what I do like though. There's a boy feeding a doll. Like I think kids should be able to have whatever kind of toys they want. Dolls does not need to be just for girls. And I recently had a conversation with Brianna who has a baby who loves dolls and my sister's daughter loves dolls too. They're like, it's not because they think it's their baby because they don't get it's what that a baby it looks is. like them. They think their doll is their friend because they're almost the same size. Yeah, but they don't need to have their, like they don't help their friend go to the bathroom. Um, my sister's daughter named her doll Grandma Julie after her <laughs> grandma. <laughs> There we go. He's been set free. Is this like a doggy? Oh, he baby? has creepy eyes too. They open, like they open and close. Okay. Do you think he likes coffee? We could feed him some coffee. Oh my gosh, his butt has a little hole. Yeah, because he poops too, I guess. Okay, so place the feeding diaper on your doll. That's what it says. Fill the bottle with fresh water. Or uh, our baby could have beer, right? Sure. Where'd our diaper go? Or our bottle go? Do you have it? I'm holding it. I'm gonna fill it up. Our baby's gonna have a little Coors Light. Cause why not? You can't start too early, can you? All right, five walks up. Back on tightly. <laughs> All right. Okay, well the camera stopped recording and we already filmed this, but now we get to see it again. Let's We're be so real. Excited. Oh You're my God, he's being on me. <laughs> That's what happened to your mom, Lily. Oh. Lily, I'm gonna, it's your son. What's his name? You name him. What, didn't we name him? What's his name? You said it was Chester. Chester just popped into my head, but maybe Hootie. I've always loved Hootie and the Blowfish. Little baby Hootie. Okay, well we're um, just it's Hootie. the directions were to shove it deep in his throat, and he could drink two thirds. Oh, oh. I know he doesn't really like beer. Oh, Annie, you don't. Ah! We're oh getting it. He's peeing on the table. Oh gosh, let's let him pee here. Let it. But let no, it but out. it's like he's not even. You he need might to be press kind the of button to do it. Yeah, okay, so let's hold him up, Lily. You no, hold him, stop moving it. Hold him over his toilet, give me the bottle, and then show the world how he urinates. Is he just dripping? Oh, there. Good job, Hootie. This is the messy, like, oh my God. This yeah, is why yeah, our moms would not let us have There's this. beer all this over the couch. This is a nightmare. We need to stop. Being a mom is hard work. Um, you guys, are there any toys that you want us to buy that we haven't showcased yet? I was gonna say to play with, but it's more to like unbox and then harshly judge. I mean, the Teddy Ruxman, I feel like they're just creepy. It feels like technology has surpassed these being our best options. I don't like it at all. But these were our best options when we were little, so. Gak, Silly Putty, they could stay. Oh. This stuff's got to go. All right, let us know what else we should try in the comments below. Don't drink the pee. Okay. I don't even like beer. It tastes like beer. Probably plasticky beer. Oh gosh, and bananas. What's inside that baby? Anyways, anyway, this video's that's over. It. <laughs> Goodbye, I don't subscribe, please. <laughs> It does kind of taste like bananas. It want to sip? No. Try it. No. Just smell it. I'll just drink the normal one. Fiona, do you want to sip a banana baby pee? I think we're done. <laughs>